YouTuber and it's Power here. I'm back um, with a booster box opening. I think I'm gonna open in one box today and maybe one tomorrow. So yeah, let's get this cracking. Cracking, cracking like a booty smacking. All right, pardon my language. I'm just like excited. Been waiting. My friends got there. It's like a heck of long ago. And like I'm finally getting mines. <sighs> okay. I think this goes in like this. Chandra thing in jigger. Alright, I'm gonna start from left to right. So there's the first pack. Hopefully something decent, yeah. I'm just gonna go straight to uncommon and then common. I mean then rare. Uh rock egg, carnage worm, uh cos costume, costume spirit, and eh, a ruin scar demon. No foil. I guess that's okay. It's not a bad card. Bear with me. Bear with me. Um, let's see. Lure. A fireball. A stream. Fling spider. And a grave titan. Sweet. I already got a playset, but first mythic, a grave titan. Not too bad, I guess. Great time's always good. I mean, the value's going up, I think. Maybe. Maybe not. First Mythic, a great time. Not bad, I guess. Um, Overrun. For the first uncommon. Elite Vanguard. Small Pops, pretty cool card. And Glacial Fortress. Not bad, a dual land. Alright. Trying to get through this whole box in like 15 minutes or so. I don't think I can, but maybe like the first section, first 12 packs or whatnot. Alright, let's go to Uncommon. Serenangel. Angel. Elixir of Immortality. Time Reinforcement. And a Garrick's Horde. Yeah. Cool. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I'll put my rears over here. So, uh, we got one Mythic. And that was a great timing. I mean, I'm thrilled, but not too thrilled. I mean, it's up a trade if anyone wants it. Um, Overrun, Consume Spirit, Celestial Proge, and a Drowned Catacomb. Pretty good. Oh, we got a Foil Pacifism. Pretty cool. Dual Lens are always good. Dual Lens are always good. Come on, give me something. Herb. All right, um, alluring siren, worm's tooth, a uh, phantasma dragon, and a mind unbound for the rare. Not bad. I'm gonna have to go through these comments and uncommon later on. See if I need anything. I don't know if I do. If I do, then I do. If I don't, I don't. I guess. All right, for the uncommon, you got an autumn veil, phantasma dragon again. Zombie infestation and a bird's paradise and a bird token. Birds of paradise. It's always cool to get birds of paradise. I was trying to get a playset. I mean, I don't want to buy it. It's like ten, fifteen dollars for a playset. Oh look, a doom blade. Uh, for the uncommon, a death mark, Kraken eye, a master thief, and first planeswalker, a sword Markov. Uh. That's funny. I was probably I was trying to trade for one too. Look, oh, look, for that pool, a Soren. What? 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 It's not the best planeswalker. Want to get Chandra or Gurk or Shay to make the box worth it? But I guess I mean I could deal with Soren. I guess maybe, maybe not. All right, so I got a great sword, Turner Frog, pretty silly card, Cage Troll, and a Quick Silver Amulet. It's not. Pr it's pretty good actually. I mean, you pay, you may pay a creature card from your hand on to the battlefield or something like that. You may put a creature card, sorry. Oh, this one looks pretty easily. Alright, rampant growth, that was good. Okay, for the uncommon, this is a rusted sentinel, a blibber ring, need that. A circle of fire, and a degen of wishes for the rare. I got two ability rings, so that's pretty cool. 
it's not bad I guess I got one in my fat pack earlier check out my video I pulled it earlier but yeah oh I'm pretty good on time since I'm just going through the uncommon so uh, so I got a Abelaster Mage Autumn Bale Celestial Purge and a Gideon's Avenger pretty decent card too not too bad alright and this pack wraps up the left side the left column I would say man going through packs like crazy alright so Arbalist Elite for the uncommon uh, Reassembly Skeleton Smallpox pretty cool and a Vengeful Sparrow alright alright so two mythic already I guess I'll keep going until like it hits 10 minutes or whatnot. Alright, so center aisle. What do you get? Center, center, center. Um, a Carnage Worm, Crimson Mage, Angelus Feather, and a Chase Archivist. It's a pretty cool card. <laughs> I don't want to make these videos too long because it gets kind of boring. Yeah, so if I'm babbling too much, I'm sorry. Alright, so we got a Singer Vampire, a Combust, a Bell Toast Spink, and a Warm Storm Surge. Okay, not too bad. I'll probably run this to like uh, 10 minutes or so. So I might have to make another video. Okay, so one box today, maybe a box tomorrow. We'll see. Alright, so Singer Vampire again. A Scepter of Emperor. Um, Empires, Aesthetic Slime, pretty good, and a World Slayer, hmm, it's alright. Okay, I'm getting tired already, I don't know if you can tell. Open the pack, get tired. Okay, so Crown of Empire, Circle of Flame, Angel's Feather, and a Solemn Simo Last. Um, a lot of people have trouble pronouncing it too. This guy right here, alright. I don't know. He's alright. Pretty decent, I guess. Hopefully, I pull like a Jace or Chandra, man, or Garrick. Alright, a Gala Bang Chucker, a Spearmanto, Jade Mage, and an Adapted Auto Maiden. Pretty cool. That's my second one. Ooh. Making a big mess over here, as you can see. Ah, all good though. Monsters. Okay, for an uncommon, it's a Azura Mage, Stormblood Berserker, Kate, Kunjil Troll, and a Goblin Chieftain. Alright. Come on, right? Give me something good. Give me something good. Make this box work it, man. Alright, so let's see here. We got um, Goblin Bang, Bang Chucker, Master Thief, Demon's Horn, and Phantasm Image, and no, no foil. Phantasm Image. I don't know what I think about that card yet. Alright, we're 8 minutes, almost 9 minutes, so I'll probably finish this section and do another video on the next section. Um, we have here a uh, Vampire Outcast. Bell Toast Tower Spink, another ability ring, pretty cool, and a personal sanctuary. And the foil is a rock egg. I guess I'm, I'm gonna get my playset of ability ring, maybe. <laughs> Probably. Some people don't be pull ability rings, it's pretty funny. I mean, it's pretty good on common. Alright, so. Okay, Scepter of, in Scepter of Emperor. Levitation, Aesthetic Slime, and a Root Bound Crag, and a Foil is a Foil Mountain. Hmm. I guess that's pretty cool. I like Aesthetic Slime. It's a 5 drop though for Death Touch. So when it's back into a battlefield, I destroy a target artifact, enchantment, or land. Hmm. Not bad. Um, Goblin Grenade, pretty cool. I'm going to keep that card right there. Flash free, though, and a, a Chandra Firebrand. Can you believe that? Woo! 
That's what I'm talking about, baby. Yeah, 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 yeah. Chandra, Chandra, I got a Chandra. That's what I'm talking about. That's my second one. Yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, two more packs. I gotta get hurry up. I gotta hurry up. I gotta hurry up. That's what I'm talking about, though. That's three mythics, so I don't think I'm gonna get any more. But we shall see. Okay, a great sword, a volcanic dragon, flash freeze, and infernal titan too. Are you serious? Now I have two places. Uh, damn it. I mean, titans are always cool. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. That's four mythics. So I don't think I'm getting any more. That's Chandra, Inferno, Grave Titan, and Soren Markov. So far. Alright, last one on this section. Let's see what we get here. We got a, a Azura Mage, a Elite Vanguard, a Jade Mage, and a Right Flourishing. Alright, thanks for watching. Um, tune in again. Alright, All right, later guys.